Hey, what's up you guys and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Nikki. And for those of you who do know me, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are not subscribed, you need to be right now subscribed to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below. Let me know what you guys would like to see. Let me know if you like this video. All positive feedback is welcome. Um, no, no negativity. No negativity. I want this to be a positive channel but you know there's still gonna be some haters out there anyway but anywho welcome new viewers and for those of you who aren't new viewers and you know me welcome back thank you so much for your support and your love i truly appreciate it from the bottom of my heart all right you guys so i know you're like what in the world no wig no makeup no nothing i just decided to just keep this introduction just all me all bare all new because the look I'm going to do is going to be very simple in my opinion but it's a full glam it's going to be a glammy one though so um I decided to just do my introduction like just bare you know just, just bare let's just let's just jump right into it because I didn't want this to be like a super extremely long video so I was like let's just let's just get on into it let's let's get on into it let's get on into it all right, you guys, so <laughs> today's video is going to be on a simple pink glittery berry eye. Of course, it's on popping berry lips. It's simple to me. It may not seem simple to you, but I'm literally only using one eyeshadow and a pink glitter. And that's seriously all that I'm using on my eyes today. It's going to be no falsies. It's going to be my natural lashes. So um, I wanted it to be like give you the illusion of full glam but also be simple and not actually cause a lot of work so of course if you want to see how i'm gonna get the look then just keep on watching y'all keep watching all right guys so we're gonna go ahead and get started now the eye portion of this video i'm going to do a talk through i feel like i don't ever like talk through any of my videos so for the eye portion i'm just gonna talk through it I'm just gonna tell you guys, you know what I'm doing. So for my eyes, I am using the Too Faced Just Peachy Matte palette. And this palette is so beautiful. I love it. So so much. And it smells like peaches. Oh my freaking god. Smells like peaches, which is another thing that I love. It smells like peaches. Alright, you guys, so Enough of that. We're going to get on into it. So the first shade I'm going to start with, I'm going to use Peach Sangria. And it is this shade here. So, so pretty. And I'm just going to take that and I'm going to pop this color into my crease. And I'm going to blend it out like a windshield wipers motion. You guys know. And just tap off the excess so you don't have powder line everywhere so I'm just gonna take this color and I'm just going to just go in and just kind of blend it and blend it blend it out now I usually don't do my eyes first I hate doing my eyes first but I'm working with glitter today so I was like I'm gonna do these uh, first. So, all right. Next, I'm gonna go in and I'm going to take this Too Faced glitter glue. It's also a glitter shadow primer, and I'm, ooh, if I don't drop it, I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna take a little bit in the back of my hand. And I'm going to use this to kind of really just kind of carve out where that glitter is going to go. So I'm going to take some of this and I'm going to put it on my lid. And I'm kind of going to use this to kind of like cut my crease just a teeny bit. Cut it. Hey, cut it. Cut it. Cut it. Hey, cut it. <laughs> and this is a double in the brush, but... It broke, y'all. So this is not a mini brush. It actually had an angled brush on the end, but it broke, so. Alright, 
right, so now that I got both, I kind of fanned them off and let them just kind of dry up a bit. I'm going to take this Too Faced Glitter, and it is wrapped in pink. It's called Wrapped in Pink. I got this in a set from Sephora, so it has like a, it had like a gold glitter, silver, and a black glitter in it. So I'm going to take this, and I'm just going to pop this exactly where I put that glitter glue at. I do like to tap off the excess of this too because when you work with glitter, it can be very, very, very messy. Alright, so this is pretty much how it's going to look like. The glitter is going to be that star of the show. The glitter is what's, you know, going to make it like pop and make you look like you did a lot of work when you really didn't. But, um, yeah. So I just took the glitter and applied it all over my lid and I'm going to go on the other eye and do the same thing because I don't want y'all to sit through that again. Alright you guys, so now that I'm going done, done with the glitter, I'm going to go in and just kind of just blend out that color a little more, you know, without disturbing the glitter, but just kind of just blend and just make sure we have a smooth transition. Do the same for both eyes. Again, not disturbing the glitter. Alright you guys, so this is pretty much it for the eyes for right now. I'm going to go ahead and do my foundation and everything off camera because I really wanted this video to pretty much be on the eyes and I want to do a talk through so I'll be right back. Alright guys, so I'm done with my foundation. I didn't want to do that off camera because like I said, I wanted this stuff to be all about my eyes. I did my brows and my foundation and everything like that off camera. So I'm going to finish up my eyes and I'm going to use this Revlon Color Stay Eyeliner in the shade Black, of course, 201 Black. And I'm going to use this to line my lower lash line. And the thing I love about this liner is the fact that it has a smudger on the end, on the opposite end from the liner, which is great because if you're looking for like a smoked out, smudgy liner look, then this is perfect to just kind of just, you know smudge that liner on out. So I can't talk by doing this, so I'm gonna go ahead and line my line. I'm gonna go back in that Too Faced um, palette and I'm gonna add the same color I use in the crease, which is this peach sangria color here. And I'm going to just smudge that onto my, underneath my lower lash line and just blend it out. That's looking real good, girl. Alright, now because I said I'm not going to use lashes, I'm going to go in and I'm going to use my L'Oreal Mascara. And the first thing I'm going to do, this is how I get my lashes to really be on fleek and elongated. I'm going to use this L'Oreal Voluminous base and this is an eyelash primer this is going to help stretch those eyelashes out and then on top i'm going to put the l'oreal voluminous lash paradise and mystic black this is my favorite mascara to use lately so i'm gonna go ahead and do that you see how this lash primer just really just stretches my little baby lashes on well, and I'm just gonna just coat the top as well. I'm gonna do this for both. I'm not using lashes today because my eyes have been really irritated. So I think I'm doing a lot as it is. So yeah, 95% of, and then I just didn't really want to and then when I have to wear lashes today. 95% of the time on my channel, you will not see me using lash. 95% of the time, you will see me using lashes. The other 5% I may not use lashes because I don't like to wear eyelashes all the time. So, I'm not one of those girls that feels like lashes are needed with every tutorial. That's not me at all. So, yeah. I'm just going to get some of the excess off because I hate having too much because it clumps my lashes together and I hate that so just gonna apply this mascara like so and I'm coating the top as well 
Never neglect the top, like, I like to take it and just kind of do a little curl motion. Never neglect the top of those lashes, honey. Most of the time when you're wearing false eyelashes, it covers it up so nobody really knows. But if you are going to do natural lashes like mine, don't neglect those part of your eyelashes because when you close your eyes, you be able to tell. Oh, and if you guys heard a long, a while, I feel like a dryer washing machine going on in the background. Cause I'm done. I ain't rich, so I gotta do my own laundry. This is why I hate when a lot of people get so much. Gets everywhere. Okay. Alright, I got a little mascara underneath, but hey, you know what? But yeah, so that's pretty much it for eyes. Now for the lips, I want to use oh my god, I love this color now. It's the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick, and this is in the shade Baca. I think that's how you say it. Baca. I'm gonna take this and just apply it all over my lips. Alright you guys, so I got my hair on. <laughs> I got my hair on. And this is the finished look, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I don't usually do like a lot of talk throughs, but I decided to just give you guys a break and give myself a break from doing the voiceovers. But um, if you want like a full talk through with foundation and everything like that, just let me know in the comments down below. And again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And of course, of course, of course, of course, if you're not subscribed, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up, share it, and leave a comment down below. Show some love in the comment section. And I'll have all of my foundation products, um, concealers, everything that I use on my face linked in the description box below. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And of course, just stay tuned for the next one. Bye.